right, we're checking out the only game where attempting a tightrope parkour only makes you balance your sanity. It's GTA. So I had gone into my email only to find I had a note from my accountant. It was Janine, and apparently she received several payment notations for expenses titled GTA makes me sad. All of our fiber <laughs> expenses are finally coming back to bite me. Can you confirm these are business transactions? So once again, we found five different people who eventually want to make me fold my keyboard in half and eat it to make a $1, $10, $100, $500, and $1,000 tightrope parkour board. And thus, it is time for us to start with the $1 tightrope board. So fancy backstory here, our normal $1 dollar store Danny kid who makes these $1 boards actually got promoted to the $10 board. That means someone else had to step up and provide incredible value for one single dollar. This actually doesn't look that bad. I'm kind of expecting one of these ladders to just go crashing down into the water, but then again, for one dollar, I really don't expect that much. I just noticed there was like a bird down there too. I'm kind of afraid it's going to come up and backhand me across the face. You're not working for the kid who did this for a dollar, are you? You have to jump on a train, LOL. What? I'm not gonna lie, for a dollar, this is actually a really good use of the surrounding environment in the game. <laughs> are you... Ready! Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> wow! I literally did that with two inches. That sounds weird. Anyway, that's the one dollar board first try! Ten dollar board! Okay, so now it's dollar store Danny's tightrope, but this time he's ten dollar Danny. At this point, like my goal one day is to eventually move Danny up to the one thousand dollar board. He just needs, you know, another thousand hours of board making. <laughs> I'm gonna land in this tree. I was wrong. Don't worry about me. I was just at the all-you-can-eat cherry pie factory. That's why I'm covered in cherry filling. Okay, Danny, I'm, I'm actually kind of concerned about ever asking you to make a, a board for a thousand dollars. Why is the ten dollar board giving me so much trouble? I learned how to make... Wait, what'd they say? I can't stop to read it because I'll die. Hold on. I... Learned how to make shooty people hit you <laughs> easy ball bang. That's like playing DDR on a tightrope. You kind of have to time everything. This should do it. Oh, yeah. And on to the other plane. Is that it or is there more? Okay, and we've completed Danny's $10 onto the $100 board. So this board, it says all I... Seriously? Oh, come on! What I was gonna say is the board creator says all you have to do is grab the end. Look at what the board does. <laughs> I should have known something was wrong. The actual board creator's name is Rick. Rick Astley. No, for real. That's how we signed up Fiverr ass. <laughs> this is just a giant troll board. Is it even possible to beat? Okay, fall down onto the first platform, shuffle over to the left, then transfer, turn left, turn right. Okay, I'm starting to learn the pattern. No, no, I'm so close. Okay, so basically I have to do this without making a single mistake. I love it. Yeah, just go ahead to the end and touch the finish line. Sure, Rick. Come on, come on. To be fair though, if he literally made this account just so that he could buy a $100 board from me, I've got to do it. Okay, fall down. And then shuffle to the left. Then right. Straight, 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 straight. Just keep running. Just keep running. Just keep running. Go run, 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 one more. And then right with an angle. Yes. Right with an angle. Straight left with an angle. Yeah. Then what? I never got this far before. Oh, fall down. Okay. Ah, that is backwards. Fall. Roll left. And right. Oh, God. I'm not going to make it. There's no way. I'm so close to dying right now. I have to cut the corner. Okay, corner's cut. Cut the corner. Pretty good. Oh, and then fall, then backwards. Yes! Okay, new personal best. Fall. No! Wait, I'm still there. Oh, oh please don't, don't go away, don't go away. We have a checkpoint, yes! I'm not gonna lie. I thought that this platform was gonna move with the checkpoint. Um. That, that, that's more of a $500 board style, so at least he showed mercy on me. Thank you, Rick. Okay, so I think this is just a transfer on the, on the platform correctly and then run and jump. So, all right, I have to go earlier than that. Wait for it, wait for it. I basically have to start running, not yet. 
Now. This looks, no, it's not good. Okay, about half a platform away, start running. There we go, this is it. This is it. Oh God. Yeah! Yeah! $100 board complete. Onto the $500 board. So the board creator said that for my $500 board, I have to learn a little bit myself and I have to assist in the creation of this. Uh, okay, so he's given me props and the ability to touch a teleporter, which freezes all the props wherever I put them. And that's how I have to complete this tightrope. I kind of feel betrayed because I don't want to pay to get smarter. I want to get paid to make my accountant embarrassed that she's associated with me. Okay, so I've been given logs. So this is obviously going to go probably here. I am so not a perfectionist. I just want this to look vaguely like I could jump on it and that should be good enough. Oh, and in case you're wondering what it's like to get your franken beans put inside of a blender, I have to do this in the end with a motorcycle. Trying to deal with these logs is like dealing with a rebellious Lego. Why do you keep running from me, log? It's because of that cell phone, isn't it? I got so tired dealing with the log, I'm just going to try and do it without it. So now lift this piece up. Yeah, see, this is this is like perfect between these two areas. Oh, all right, it's totally like it's staggered and not straight at all, but I think I can still do it. And lift. I hate my life. There we go. Oh, or not. Will you behave? Hey, board creator, is there a reason why you put a couple of these like behind a windmill? Are you are you serious right now? Oh, I landed it on the wheels. Okay, drive through the windmill. Grab the pink plank of self-loathing. <laughs> what? No joke. I've spent like 30 minutes putting this board together. Okay, so I think I have everything set up where it needs to go. So now click on the freeze props. All right, then grab this. It's like putting a puzzle together. It's like where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Pink motorcycle. All right, now let's see how hard your actual board is. Perfect. Okay, so this is just a timed piece like this. There we go. Onto the logs that I made, which ended up killing me. I rest now. So real quick, my my one log just isn't working. So I'm gonna try something real quick there because I'm not sure I can make this jump. And I'm, he said I'm allowed to use anything on the board. So I'm gonna put this right here. Boom, perfect. All right, forklift. Oh, ooh. Okay, so not yet. Now, across the thick wood that I have provided. See, now we actually have space. Pop a wheelie. Ah, I'm gonna make this work. I don't care what it takes. Cause I don't feel like trying to- oh! <laughs> I don't feel like trying to get that piece of wood back onto the platform. <laughs> All right, you know what? We're not gonna, we're not gonna need the forklift. I'm just gonna do this with speed. And punch it! Yes! Oh, thank you. All right, what else you got for me? So this is what I made. Look at this, huh? Basically, all I did was pay someone else to put to kick myself in the groin. Spin the back end around, line it up. There we go. This is fine. I'll just go ahead and touch the solid air that has congealed itself due to how much I've disappointed. The, the accounting team that I've hired. All right, go, 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 stop. All right, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take like 20 feet and that should be enough because I don't want to shoot off to the right. This is for Janine! All right, you know what? We're gonna start back a little bit farther here. And go. Boop. <laughs> Perfect. Uh. Oh. Okay, so I have to do kind of like a tilt here. Move the back end around a little bit. What is that in front of me? Is that like a new pro legend bend in the in the map or something? Ah, whatever. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, it's a drop. My spatial awareness is terrible. Ah, right in the middle. That is nowhere near the middle. Right in the middle. Yes. There's nothing here, right? There's nothing here that's gonna like backhand me off. No suddenly appearing windmills or anything. No, I guess not. I'm so cautious right now because I just. I feel like something's going to jump out and stop me. Is it a winner? It's a winner! Onto the thousand dollar board! Okay, so the board creator said that they really wanted to give me my value for this board. So they made it, at least part of it, a legitimate tightrope. Okay, I mean, so far this actually doesn't- Okay, it's a lot worse than I thought it was gonna be. 
I've been given a taser. I'm not actually 100% sure how that's going to play into the board. Maybe I'm just supposed to tase myself. Is that... Is that windmill moving? The windmill's moving. Like, it's slowly shuffling. There is a literal landslide ahead of me. <laughs> Hold on, let me just get past the windmill, which apparently can go forward and backward. Okay, yeet. Perfect. Okay, so while the windmill just randomly... Oh, now it's chasing me. I was gonna say, while it nopes out of here, I would show you the rock slide, but I need to go before it kills me. So does it keep coming like all the way through the board? I ended up falling off of the tightrope onto this little area. That's the rock slide. What am I supposed to do with that? Okay, no joke. I don't know how long this board is, but at nope. this point, I, uh, I've seen the windmill. I've seen a rock slide. There's like fire up ahead, like a volcano or something. I need to watch the tightrope not get hit by the windmill, have enough time to get past it. <laughs> okay, so can I jump over this? Oh God, this is the first time I've gotten this far. Oh, I hate my life. Okay, jump over the first thingy. Now I have to figure out a way to get past the rock slide. I, I don't even know how you're supposed to beat this. Uh, Yeah, we're just gonna wing this. You know, it would be great. A checkpoint. I just need to run in first person. It's the only way to do it because I need to do this while... This is gonna be like my Captain Planet element because me and the bowlers are becoming extremely good friends. Oh, this looks good. This looks good. Good, go, 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 go. Oh, oh, oh. There's like a, there's like an area of solace right here. Okay, so there's boulders crashing behind me. And then there's boulders crashing right there. And then there's just like volcanic eruptions ahead. Okay, get past the secondary boulders. Not yet. This is about as close as I can get. Go! Oh! Oh! This is the most vicious tire rope! <laughs> They're like, great. A cat has nine lives. How many would you like? And I'm like, yes! Oh, this is working. Okay. All right. I got to the middle portion. Now I kind of need to wait until two boulders. Yeah. Okay. Like when two boulders hit right there, I should have enough time to get past this. Sweet! Is this... Is this like a legitimate electric thing or does this actually hurt or is this just here for looks? Ah, uh, yeah, it'll be fine. Okay, so Ooh. you... You're kidding me. That actually works. No! I'm waiting for my call from Axe Body Wash so they can create a gel out of my tears. I'm gonna produce enough of them, yeah! Okay, new personal best. So forward, and then we have another electric thing. So wait for it, yeet, perfect. And then a third electric thing, and we're getting closer to the lava. And three strikes are out, oh no! <laughs> so I finally got all the way over here, you know, from dying to the electricity. What is that? I didn't know there was logs gonna kill me too. I just wasn't really focused on it. I'm trying to beat uh, one thing at a time. I just want to get past the last electrocution thing. Death. Yes. Finally. <laughs> what is the logs? Is it logs and a guy shooting a gun? Okay, this board is insanely long. I kind of felt like I had gotten scammed on the $500 board, but I'm definitely getting the value for the $1,000 board. No, 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 no! Honestly, if I have to eat all of this bark, the rest of you get to enjoy it with me. Okay, this is this looks good. This looks good. Go, 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 go. We're gonna make it. We're, we made it. 100% we made it. Yes! Also, I think that guy ran out of bullets or something. Okay, so it wasn't lava. It's like a bunch of... I can't believe I just did that. Okay, I'm back where I was before I decided to just make my life a thousand times harder. What I was trying to say before I just jumped off of the tightrope was it's not a volcano. There's actually just a bunch of people shooting flares at this guy. So the board creator gave me a taser. I thought it was just so I could legitimately get on this tightrope and like first person it while using the taser out like this. But I think it's to shoot these guys because I'm pretty sure they'll set me on fire. What's this say? Hey, he can't see us. Shoot more flares. Roger that. SOS. Oh, okay. He actually put a little helicopter down over there. <laughs> okay. So far, so good. Yeah. 
Their aim doesn't actually look that good, so I. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that of you're course. fine. Of course. You're not really fine. What I was going to say is their aim didn't look that good, but maybe it's a little bit better than I gave it credit for. Okay. This this looks this looks decent. This looks de. <sighs> hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and lick this fern. Okay, run, run, run. Maybe I should just run. I feel like this is just a matter of luck. The one guy is definitely homing on me. Okay, so he does aim. I thought they were shooting at the same spot. <laughs> oh my God, it's a checkpoint. No! <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, checkpoint. <laughs> Okay, so that's the end. So I have to tightrope. Well, I messed that up. What I was gonna say is I have to tightrope on this and then one of the gondolas is moving. If you, if, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like really slowly shuffling from side to side. Well, you might not be able to see it now because I'm murdering myself. Okay, onto the tightrope, taser out. Nice and slow, nothing shooting at me. I don't have logs trying to cram my uvula out my rectum. All I have to do, what's this like? We're over the weight limit? Oh! <laughs> this is a giant flame! <laughs> what do you have to do? How do I get to the other gondola? It just, it just sets you on fire, so I have to do it before the flame? Okay, I have an idea. We're gonna jump down. So what I'm gonna do, I think what I'm supposed to do is stay on top of this and then jump over to the other gondola. I'm actually really apprehensive about this because I, I failed so many times. All of my confidence has been destroyed. Okay, all the way back and then it will start coming back this way and then run and jump and land it, perfect. Oh, it shuffles while you're on it. Real quick. Uh, get wrecked. <laughs> I just wanted to have one other person feel my pain. So now, with perfect timing, wait until it gets right over the end, and there's nothing in this world that can stop me. Thousand dollar board. Are you serious right now? <laughs> Whatever. This gives me time to do that. <laughs> and now... Finally, thousand dollar board is completed. Well, I'm gonna go email Janine back while wiping the tears from my eyes. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of GTA. Till next time, stay foxy and much love.